Hi there, Gemini. Thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 6th of January. This is one of those weeks which shows us rich promise, but there is potential slip-ups that can creep in too. And it comes at the start of this week because of two prominent influences. The first is an opposition between the Sun and Jupiter, which could make you very positive and very go-getting around your prospects around finances, business interests, speculation, risk-taking. But Jupiter, which is the planet of fortune, can also trick us into believing that things will turn out well without too much effort on our part. And it's going to be important that you don't kid yourself into being overconfident and find yourself in too much of a hurry to go into something that's a little bit risky or you haven't done your research on. There's also a clash between Mars and Pluto, which continues this week on from last week. This points towards more dissatisfaction around the areas of life that you share with another person. It could be in your love life if someone feels a bit too clingy, or perhaps in your case, they don't seem needy enough. And some kind of issue there could be going on romantically, or it could be about shared finances. In a business situation, if you feel that you're particularly productive and creative, but the person that you're involved with, whether it's colleagues, co-workers, or a business partner, aren't pitching in quite as much as you feel they should do, that can cause some dissatisfaction. Yet diplomacy really can take you far this week, Gemini. And your ruling planet Mercury is going to be alongside Venus for a lot of this week. And although Venus is tracking backwards still, in Capricorn it's asking us not to rush decisions, to be cautious, but it is ruled, of course, Capricorn by Saturn, so it's asking us to do due diligence. And by the end of this week, both Mercury, Venus and also the Sun all come into contact with Saturn itself, which is in the part of your horoscope that's to do with precision and details. So if you can couple a real thoroughness with a self-confidence, you can have a winning formula. It's if the either gets tipped in too much of one direction. So if you're overconfident or feel that something just can't possibly work out and you're fearful, that's when you perhaps could come unstuck. But if you do your homework and really do it thoroughly, but you still feel that what you're doing can be productive and earn you more money or improve your financial situation, then this is a week which most certainly can be productive. The only area that I think is a little bit of a glitch for you in the second half of the week comes on the back of Wednesday's quarter moon, which suggests that money and friendship, for once, really may not go together. So you're best to steer clear. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now.